in this our second tutorial on logs we're going to look at the addition rule so what it actually says if I have log of a number plus log of another number then the answer is log of those two numbers multiplied together the thing to bear in mind though that each of these logs must be to the same base what I want to start off by doing is proving this to you so we're going to start off with the um, definitions so we've got log to the base a of b equals y and log to the base a of c equals x well that implies that a to the y equals b and a to the x equals c so now let's multiply one equation by the other and we get a to the y multiplied by a to the x equals bc so using um, the multiplication rule for indices we get a to the x plus y equals bc now going back to our definition for logs that's going to give us log to the base a of bc equals x plus y but x from up here we know is just going to be log to the base a of c and y from up here we know is just log to the base a of b so that proves our rule that um, log to the base b plus log to the I'm sorry log of b plus log of c equals log of bc the first example we've got here is log of 3 plus log of 5 so what do we get here then so we just get log and 3 multiplied by 5 is 15 the second one log of 2 plus log of x we just get log and 2 times x is 2x this next one log of x plus log of x plus log of x and we play close attention to this one it will come up in another tutorial well that's just going to give us log of x times x times x so that's going to be log of x cubed okay they're quite simple but let's look at this other problem we've got here so we've got log to the base 2 of x plus log to the base 2 of x plus 2 they're both to the same base so we can add them together to give us log to the base 2 of x squared plus 2x and that equals 3 well that implies that x squared plus 2x equals 2 to the power of 3 which is 8 so that implies that x squared plus 2x minus 8 equals 0. If we solve this quadratic we're going to get x equals um, x equals minus 4 or x equals 2. But because we've got this one here logs must always be positive that means that this answer is not possible so the answer is x equals 2. So here we have some questions for you to practice with. You can pause the video, give them a go and then watch the solutions at the end. Okay, so this first one we've got log 5 times 2y of 10y. The next one, log of x times log of x is going to be log of x times x, so that's log of x squared. And now we have one of these problems again. So this is going to give us log to the base 4 of x minus 3 times x plus 3, so that's x squared minus 9, which equals 2. Well, that implies that x squared minus 9 equals 4 to the power of 2 which is 16 
So that implies that x squared equals 25, which implies that x equals plus or minus 5. Well, positive 5 works in both of our original logs, because that will give us log of 2 and log of 8, so that's perfectly OK. But the minus 5 actually doesn't work in either case, so minus 5 is not possible. So the answer is x equals positive 5. So here are some questions for you to, to, um, to try, discuss with friends, and um, see what conclusions you come to. I hope you found the tutorial helpful.